Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we will try to understand what is meant by process in operating system. In our previous class, we have clearly discussed about uh, this diagram. So, where we have discussed about the intuition about the operating system. If you haven't watched it, uh, this video, please watch this video and come back here. And every video on our channel is going to be part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have better understanding of the concepts. And the link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Now, what is meant by a process? process a process is a program in execution so the program in execution is called as process so what does that mean is whenever we want to execute a program that program will get stored on the hard disk so that program will be stored on the hard disk in a file so whenever we want to execute that we will uh, compile that program so that program will get converted into byte code so it will get converted into machine level language okay so now once it it got converted and if you want to run that program if you want to run that program so that program will be shifted from hard disk to the main memory so before shifting it from the uh, process uh, shifting it from the hard disk to the main memory so that program will be allocated with some memory so what does that mean is so this is that this is how the process will look like so what happened here is in this diagram this is what the process is so in this diagram we are having the text part so this part is what we call it as the program in binary code so in zeros and ones so to this program to this program memory has been allocated so what what kind of memory is it it is a stack stack will get added heap will get added and data part will get added data section will get added so what are this is uh, what this data part so what this uh, memory is used for is in order for this program to execute so whenever a program is getting executed it uses this memory for the execution of that program so what happens here is whenever a function call is made the 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 details about that function call so for that function call the local variables of that function will get stored a new stack record will get created for every function call a new stack record will get created in that stack record the variables that are there in that function will get stored and what about this heap is whenever a dynamic memory so dynamic memory is allocated by using malloc calloc or realloc so whenever such kind of memory runtime memory is getting created so that runtime memory will get created in this heap section and all the data variables uh, sorry global variables and uh, static variables will get created in this data section so for this program the memory that is getting allocated so the combining com, uh, combining the memory to the program is what we call it as a process and whenever we run this process whenever we run a program that will get converted into a process and it will get shifted from hard disk to main memory so it means that so whenever it is getting shifted to main memory means it is the program in execution so so that the instructions of that program will be shifted to the CPU so this is all so the creation of a program so the the process from a program is done by the operating system okay so this is what we call it as a process in operating systems hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching